Hey y'all, you American Girl fans. We are going to look today and see what's new on the American Girl online website. There are so many new things that American Girl has kind of been sprinkling in here at the late spring, early summertime instead of having like a big release all at once like last summer with Be Forever or with Grace Thomas's, you know, a usual girl of the year big release at the beginning of the year. So we have new things for Grace. We have new things out for the My American Girl doll line, which is now called Truly Me. It was My American Girl. It was just like you. Now it is called Truly Me. And they have all kinds of new things. They have new outfits and new accessories. And we've got like the recess ready outfit. We've got the sparkle sweater outfit. There's a new basketball outfit. There's outfits for dolls. There's outfits for girls. And they're all really, really cute. So be sure to check them out either online or in the store. The one that I want to highlight because I just couldn't stop laughing when I saw it is the mod monster costume for dolls. It is hilarious almost to the point of being ridiculous. I mean, the first time I saw it, I was just laughing so hard. And I was thinking to myself, who in the world is going to want to buy this? That is just ridiculous. It's, it's hilarious. But every time I saw it, it made me laugh. And I realized that, yeah, you know, that, that makes people happy. So let's take a close look here. It's got this awesome oversized black and white felt wig. It is so hilarious. I cannot believe it. And it's got cute little boots and a little trick-or-treat bag. So yeah, it is just so funny. And so, oh my gosh, I don't know if I'll get it, but it's just fun to look at. And American Girl has done something a little unusual here. So, okay. The next thing we're going to take a look at is all the new things for Grace Thomas. She has quite a few new things. And we have, um, as soon as it clicks over here, a new baking kit. It's really fabulous. It's for uh, girls who want to play um, having a bakery. And there's a book that tells you what to do. An oven mitt, patisserie bags, bread bags, chalkboard, stickers, sign papers and punch outs for boxes and all kinds of really cute stuff. This looks like a lot of fun for girls to play um, making a bakery just like Grace did. And she's got a new Grace's sightseeing outfit which is fairly reasonable in price for what you get. You get a sweater, skirt, and a pair of shoes and it's it's really cute. I really like this a lot. There is also an accessory set that comes with it. It's um, a little red cape and a black pair of boots and a teal pair of sunglasses. And that is sort of expensive for what you get, but it's just so cute. And how can it not go with the, her new Grace's sightseeing outfit? And there's also lots of new things for girls in Grace's collection. There's bracelets and t-shirts and travel cases. And of course her new DVD, which there's a link down below if you want to buy it somewhere else besides American Girl through Amazon. There's a phone wristlet for girls, a stationery set, a jewelry and photo keeper for girls. So yeah, there's a lot of really new cute stuff for girls in Grace's collection. And so we're going to be moving on to the Be Forever. Host Safina has some new stuff. She has a new nightgown, which has an adorable ribbon that matches her bed and her slippers match her new bed which we'll see in just a minute she's also got some cute trim around the edge of her pajamas so very cute and the price is still $24 for all the pajamas that I could see and that's really great the price did not go up so I'm really excited about that because when it comes to affording everything like I usually want everything it'll be a little easier so first we were going to try to show a picture of her old bed, but that did not work. So her old bed is a sleigh bed. It's teal in color. Here's her bedding. It's a quilt and a sheepskin. And here is her new bed. It is pretty much the same. Her new bed is also a sleigh bed. It is white instead of the teal blue. It's got a really pretty blanket that matches her pajamas, a little roll for a pillow. It is very adorable and the price is still the same as it was. And it's very authentic. She's got mattress called the Colchin and I'm saying it wrong, a pillow called an Almohada. And I really love how they include that bit of culture with um, their 
be forever lines and historical characters. She also has nighttime accessories, which is a little expensive for what you get, but all the items are such high quality. You can tell that the candlestick is made out of metal and that the little inkwell with the feather is a glass thing. So it's worth it. Now let's look at Rebecca. Rebecca gets a new pair of silky purple pajamas. We're really looking at lots of purple for Rebecca lately with the new Be Forever line. And they're satiny instead of cotton like her previous. And we also have her new bed, which is very similar to her old bed. Very similar. Looks to be more silky rather than cotton. And it's purple. Her old bed was pink. It had almost exactly the same frame, just a little bit of a different color. But it's very cute, and it's it's very reasonable at price, too. I'm just really excited to see that American Girl didn't raise their prices. She also has bedroom accessories, which is, again, a little higher in price. But, I mean, look what you get. It is adorable. I love the nesting dolls. They are so awesome. And it comes with a mini domino set. It comes with a book, Rebecca of Sunnybrook Farm. And it comes with a cloth bag that holds Rebecca's crochet supplies. So it is really well worth it if you are a... Rebecca fan or not. Very, very cute. Next we have Addie and Addie gets these beautiful, adorable white pajamas with blue trim and I just love her hair. Her hair is so cute. I am hoping to try that style on Addie and it's, it's just such a different approach and I just love it. So she has new pajamas. So exciting. And her new bed is very, very similar to her old bed. The frame is almost exact. It is the woven rope instead of the bed springs, just authentic to her um, Civil War era. And she's got a beautiful blue colored quilt rather than her multicolored one from uh, the historical line. And it is just so pretty. It's, uh, Addie's getting lots of blue and purple in her collection. And it's just, it's so, it's nice. She also gets bedroom accessories, very similar to her old ones, with her doll and her lamp. And I'm not sure if the book is new, the Mother Goose book. But it's a little bit less expensive at $42. Doesn't seem to come as much with as many things as the other bedroom accessory sets but still very very cute I just love Addie's collection and Kaya yay Kaya gets a new dress she sticks with her old TP and bedroll and this dress is quite expensive $42 but it is so well made and very pretty I just I simply love her powwow dresses I will definitely have to think about getting this one and Julie, oh, okay, this has got to be the most awesome thing, in my opinion. I love her new pajamas. They are so cute. And there's girl-style pajamas that come with them. The top is zigzag and the bottom is pink, but they are the same colors, same pattern. So, so cute. I just love it. I love these pajamas. They're so adorable. And 24 bucks. what can you say? Good deal. And her new bed is very similar to her old bed, which I'm gonna try and bring up here in just a second. Okay, old bed. There's Julie's old bed, and it looks like a great bed for the era. So when we go to the new bed, which is very, very similar. Oh, there's her vanity set. She never had a vanity set before, so there it is. It's awesome, little expensive. But there is, coming up here, her new bed. Wow, same colors, just a little switch around with the patterns. The bed frame is purple instead of orange, but you know, it's, it's cool Julie stuff and I just love it. It is very pretty. And Kit has such cute new pajamas. Oh my gosh, they are so adorable. It opens up at the bum so she can go to the bathroom. That is too much. I just love it. Okay, so here is Kit's old bed. This is what it looked like. And then we have Kit getting a new bed. And it actually looks very, very similar. It just has some of those new brighter colors that you see like in Kit's meat outfit. 
and it's got the same frame it still has the trundle bed option where you can open it up into a bigger bed so not a trundle bed but like a fold out bed it's very very cute um, Kit also did get an accessory she got a radio which is a big surprise because in Molly's old collection she was the one with the radio this one is very cute. It looks so adorable. It has a dial that lights up, a volume control knob, and you can tune the knob and the needle moves when you turn the knob. You can also hear real recorded news from the 30s or there is a cable th so that you can attach your own music player and play your own songs through this old fashioned radio. So it's very cute. I did notice, however, that it does appear to be plastic. And I believe Molly's old radio was wood, so it's not as high quality, but it is sure cute. And that is $42, so a little bit high price for a piece of plastic, but I think if you're a Kit fan, you would just love this. I know I am. So anyway, that looks like it is about it for today. So if you get a chance to check out and see what's new at American Girl, it's definitely worth it. And I'm sure there's more new things to come. We're going to have a new Be Forever character this year, so that's going to be really exciting too. And I um, just want to say another goodbye to Caroline. It's really sad to see her go. It was sad to see her not get new pajamas and a new bed, just like all the other girls. But times change, and we're getting really excited to see Mary Ellen. So thanks so much for, for watching, and we'll keep you posted about what's new with American Girl. Bye!